number one touristic attraction that makes it constant and more unique is this little beach you see me and known as Mamaya Beach. <laughs> As you see behind me here, it is surrounded by hundreds of hotels along this coast region. So accommodation is way more available for you guys to enjoy during the summer holiday. Number three little attraction here in Constanta people you might need to visit and that is Thomas. Harbor. So Tommy's Harbor is just this one little behind me here. You see guys on the background behind from that side all the way coming to that. That's the harbor. Tommy's Harbor. But actually this name Tommy's was the name for this city of Constanta back in those days. But now it's known as Constanta. So even Tommy's Harbor we can just say it's Constanta Harbor. <laughs> When you do all those visiting, don't forget to visit this Constanta Casino. Casino, Constanta Casino, or Casino, I don't know how do you say it. It's just beneath the Black Sea Ocean here, as you see, and a lot of people, tourists also, they roam around here. You can see how it is crowded just to see people just walking around this area. So it's one among also the best places, and there are also a lot of places where you can take good pictures. Here in Constanta, so Constanta Casino should also be at your next list of places to visit here in Constanta. And good music are going on from our old grandfather here. In our list you might need to visit Telegondola Din Mamaya which is the teleferic around here in Mamaya. From here you can get your ticket and it's just here. Let me show you. So this one here. So when you when you grab your ticket and you get into this Telegondola or teleferic you are ready to get to see the view around uh, around this coastal region for this Mamaya Beach. Trust me, it, it, they have a good aqua aquarium and a good environment whereby you can enjoy whenever you take this kind of telegondola transport to see that view from the top because it comes like aerial view, aerial view, guys.
number six in our list is the Ovidio Square, the square you see right behind me here all around this area. The Ovidi Square is also one among the best places where to visit and have the experience of your own by walking by. You can see how the square looks like. The next attraction in our list is Delfinario and I just finished getting my ticket here. As a student you got a discount so just pay 3 ron or 3 lei which is almost uh, 0. Point something dollars but for tourists you pay 12 which is almost uh, we can say 4 dollars no 3 dollars. So you can see here we are in front of the building for Delfinario and inside we're gonna see the dolphins. We have shown over here, some of them were just seen here. And this is outside. I can't wait to attend this fantastic show today. So, in front of Delfinario here, direct from Constanta, let's go inside and enjoy our amazing, beautiful Delfinario show. Dolphins, people playing with the dolphin inside. But wait, prior to the Delfinario show, here also there is a zoo, so you can actually walk into the zoo to see all the animals available, like ducks, we saw them back there. Ducks walking, and here you can see goats. Here also ostrich, ostrich, ostrich guys. And more, many more animals are located at this zoo, so you can have also a view or a look, a walk at this zoo prior to the Alfinario show, because the show will be starting evening. So. That's how we just having a short walk over here at Delfinario, a zoo. After there is where we'll go for the show. But you can choose if you wanna just visit the, the zoo, you pay for the zoo. If you wanna just visit the attend the Delfinario show like your boy, you choose to attend, you pay for that. So for me, I just attend the Delfinario show and I took you guys here so that to give you a little more detail. God, it is about to start construction of boy. done with all those places to visit don't forget Carol one mosque also right behind me here you can see this is Carol one mosque or they call Royale mosque you know la la mosque Royale Royale guys the pronunciation is a bit weird but the mosque is just here at Constanta beneath this touristic attraction just behind here so whenever you are passing on this part also don't forget to have a look a visit at this beautiful mosque here 